All right, day seven. So this is the first week that we now finished and um, yeah, I'm oh, starting to feel already a bit exhausted from all the exercises that I've done. Um, today we were kind of like fine-tuning our billboard message. So basically, yeah, if you had a one-liner that you put on your LinkedIn profile, what you do and what you offer, what would that be? And I had previously done a course before where we would do the same thing and it was kind of in the same structure and the sentence like, I help somebody achieve something by my approach. And yes, like a day, I think it was day two or day one when we had to find our niche, I started feeling a bit frustrated again because I felt like my niche wasn't quite right and I changed the word in my niche to kind of like, yeah, broaden it up a bit. In the beginning, my niche was more um, women related, like I wanted to focus on helping women. And today I felt like, well, <laughs> From all the students I've had, I also know that I work really well with men or men really like to work with me, like yeah, business professionals and there are a lot of <laughs> male business professionals. So I just changed it to include all genders and yeah, right, because also the male and female and women and men, it's also quite, it's not inclusive enough in our world. So, okay. Um, and then yes, I kind of formed a sentence and um, yeah, it's... If you create this sort of promise, something that you can help the student with, it sounds really grand. And I'm somebody who's used to taking things, you know, not through a super like strategic process and very intuitive. I like to do things by, you know, seeing what comes up and then reacting to what comes up and how my feelings change over things. And when I study myself, I don't have a full structured program. I mean, more or less, I know what I have to learn and apps are sort of structured, but I'm quite flexible with, you know, reacting towards what I need. But the idea here is that you have like a fixed program that you're selling and, you know, there's a promise of what this program can do. And it does feel quite overwhelming to me, um, to be honest. And yeah, we were learning a bit on mindset on, you know, if you make a statement like I help business professionals um, achieve their career goals by um, perfectionizing their English. It sounds so grand, right? It's like a massive statement and it makes you feel intimidated as a teacher and you're wondering whether you can fulfill that promise. But in a way, <laughs> you will not help the business professionals, for example, get the job or they won't get a better job because of you. They still have to do the work, but you are kind of like helping them in one way, right? Um, you're nudging them and say, okay, well, maybe you need better English so I can help you and guide you on that and set you up, up on the right path. But yeah, again, it's a very like business mindset that you have to get in. And yeah, being a teacher is extremely hard because all I want is to, yeah, to, to fine tune, to personalize the class to my student, see how they're going, you know, adapt each class to see where they want to go. And then having like an end goal, it seems, yeah, quite grand and quite big. So. I will have to find a more structured approach to my own way of working in that regard um, in order to sell this program. So for sure, I think there will always be some flexibility because it's not set in stone and I'm just creating a framework and I'm just creating an end message. So I think I will still be able to make some small adjustments here and there and adapt to the student accordingly. But yes, it's again the, from the teacher's mindset to the business mindset. All right, um, let me know what you think and leave a comment. You can subscribe and share this video with somebody who might, yeah, need the help. Again, I'm just voicing my thoughts here. I'm just trying to a kind of like learn better or remember better what I've learned today and b connect with people. Cause I know that when you have these thoughts, you could be quite alone in yeah in your little world trying to make sense of all of this and i just want to 
share my thoughts to show other people that they're not alone and that you know many people are in this so i'm hoping you find this helpful thanks so much for watching and yeah see you tomorrow